This here is 46-year-old Brandon, and on one cold Sunday afternoon in a small town in Ohio, he ventured out to pick up a delicious delicacy from his local Mexican restaurant. But when he got to this restaurant, he was bombarded by me and was shown a wanted nudist flyer with his face on it. So this is the, uh, the individual. Have you, I don't know uh, who that is. It doesn't look uh, familiar to you at all. It's not me. It's not me. It's not, it, what, what, what's your name, sir? Now this had to have been the last thing that Brandon was expecting to run into on this day. I mean, you can't really blame him. So of course at first he denied everything, but eventually he admitted to everything. You may be wondering how we got this information on Brandon and how we obtained this monstrosity of a picture of him with his buns out. Well, it all started on the good old TikTok app where Brandon would frequently go live and chat with users who would pop into his stream. But one day, Brandon decided to engage in a conversation with a cupcake. We'll just call it that so that YouTube doesn't demonetize us. Now, obviously, after some point, this conversation did get rather inappropriate. We'll just say that. I can't get too much into the specifics of the chat log here on YouTube, but if you want to see the full chat log, of Brandon, you can head on over to skeetergene.locals.com. Here you can also find this video uncensored and more. Now obviously this is illegal activity, so we had to make a report to the police. Not only did we do that, but we actually got Brandon to get in his car and drive himself to the police station. I am not making this up and you're about to find out firsthand on this episode of Deskeet Predator. What up, boys? It's your, your boy Skeet Hanson back at it again. We're here in the f boonies. Once again, as you can see, we're at a Circle K gas station right around the corner from this guy's house. But, uh, what, what city is this again? Wasson. Wasson. Or Wasin. Wasin or Wasson, yeah. Ohio. Ohio. In the middle of nowhere. Middle of nowhere. We are going to go to this guy's house here. <laughs> this is a. <laughs> Uh, oh my picture that he took of himself in the in the shower now this guy has been having a very sexually charged conversation online with who he thinks is a um I believe it was a um on tiktok so this is a little different he um went live on tiktok the decoy joined she said something in the chat brandon started talking to her then it went to um personal messaging on tiktok and then it went to text but the most essential part is that he sent this very questionable picture of uh, his ass, basically. So he lays in bed on his stomach and uh, goes like this, does one of these. He's completely naked. You can see his ass and everything. And he sent it to the girl with his face in it. So I went ahead and made a wanted nudist uh, flyer. And I made a few of them and I'm gonna post them all around this town here. This is uh, what we're looking at here. It's right here says uh wanted nudist it's kind of like a like a old wild west type uh wanted poster and uh yeah there's the picture he took we had a sensor with a little cowboy emoji there and uh they, you know there's his face and you know it's his, his whole ass is in hanging out in this picture and uh you know we got a uh, you know fifteen hundred dollar reward for any <laughs> for anyone that uh finds this man this uh this wanted nudist uh hopefully he's back home from getting his uh was it mexican food should be Oh, I, I could put a, I could put it like right here, <laughs> like on the electrical box. Like he's gonna drive out one day and see it. <laughs> All right, we're just gonna post a flyer up right, right on this one. So like, when it, whenever he drives out of here, he'll see it. I just hold it up for me there. Good piece of tape there. Yeah, we'll, we'll do one more. Uh, let me get one more. We'll do one more, like over, just over there. All right, we're on the hunt for a nudist, boys. All right, so that's uh, one wanted nudist sign put up right there. Let's put this one right here. You know, people need to need to know that there's you know a nudist around here. And one more for the bottom. All right. And there we have the. Yeah, it's not going anywhere. I don't think. 
All right, they're all over town now, so. Before he sent some uh, verification photos of his uh, his property. There's one. Oh yeah, it's definitely the house yep. then right there. You know, let's, so while we're at it here, before, while his page is still up, let's check him out a little bit. See what type of content he's got. Yeah. What the hell? Since my birthday is now a federal holiday, <laughs> I want to see how rare it is by this filter. So let's... Get it up there. Okay. Listening to Toby Keith. <laughs> Look at this one. The fuck is this? <laughs> <laughs> what the? F he's not a. He's, he's not a smart guy. What at the all. F is this? What are you? This is shit that like twelve-year-olds do he's on TikTok. A fucking, he's a fucking idiot. <laughs> That's fucking music. This is like the white are trash we, music. Are, are, are we <laughs> This guy might be too stupid to insult. Maybe. Let's, let's see one where he's like looking normal, kind of. Bruh. What the f- he turned himself bla <laughs> black. Blackface? <laughs> Dude, I'm so confused. Uh. Why post this? Why? I don't- I legitimately don't understand. Was it during February? <sighs> I think so. Yeah, I'll see. Okay, well, that's Brandon. That's the kind of shit he's posting on TikTok here. All right, time to go knocking. Good. Maybe he's not back yet. Maybe he's not back yet. I don't know. It looks like no one's home. All right, so he's still talking to the decoy. He is um, at a Mexican joint ordering a, a specific dish. And we looked up all the Mexican joints that are around here. There's only three within like a two mile radius. And we narrowed it down to the one that he's probably at. And the dish he ordered was what again? Arras con pollo. It was an arras con pollo. And we narrowed it down. Only one of the restaurants around here has that dish, right? Chicken rice. Okay, so uh, yeah, must be uh, that one. So let's go, let's just check if he's there waiting on his, uh, waiting on his order. Pulling up to the Mexican joint here. Let's see if we see a Honda Odyssey anywhere from the records. It looks like that is the car that he owns. Don't ask if there's an order for Brandon. <laughs> Don't ask that. No. <laughs> Don't ask that. Let's pretend like I have a carry out. Yeah, it's, it's All right, so now Rick is going in to have a gander and see if he sees Brandon. And they're waiting. See what the word is. Busy, but he's not in there. Yeah, she said he's watching TV. Let me see here. Let me see if we got any updates. Honda Odyssey. There we go. The there, 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 there's the Odyssey. That, that loop around, yeah. I'm just gonna walk by six feet. Uh. Cute, just kind of be uh, just do one of these with the camera, be kind of low key. How you doing? Oh, we're just uh, we're more just here for information. We're part of the bounty hunting team. Uh, there has been reports of a, uh, a wanted uh, nudist here. I don't know if you've seen this flyer around here. Have you seen a gentleman looks like this? Mm. There, uh, let's see. It's uh, a better picture of him there. Mm. Feel familiar? No. Hasn't been here recently. Uh, okay. I don't think so. Okay. Yeah. Right, thank you for your cooperation. Uh, uh, yeah. Thanks. Appreciate it. You're welcome. Yeah. Hey, excuse me, sir. I know we're we're just part of the bounty hunting squad in the area. Uh, we've had reports about just a wanted nudist on the loose. We've uh, we've been asking everyone in town here. What? You, a wanted nudist in in the area. Have you heard of that? No. no. 
Okay, because we've been handing around, handing, uh, around the flyers everywhere. We post them all over town already and in people's mailboxes. Uh, just to make you aware, sir, this, it's, this is the, uh, the individual. If you, I don't know uh, who that is. It doesn't look uh, familiar to you at all? Okay, because no. his, his name is uh, Brandon. He has a, a TikTok. He's been sending this picture to many females on the TikTok app. Okay. And we just, we really need to find him. I don't know who he is. No. Okay. Well, I'll hand you the flyer. Okay. You keep it with you. Okay. If you, you see, you see that gentleman, just make sure you report it to the, the sheriff. Okay. All right. Wait, hold, hold on. Can, can, can I see that room? Hold on. So yeah, if you flip it open and just that face, remember that face. Okay. Wait, hold on. This. It's not me. It's not me. It's not. It, what, what, what's your name, sir? Charlie. 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 Charlie what? Brian. Charlie Brian. This, yeah. this looks an awful lot like you. I don't have the, a beard. You don't have a beard. Okay. But let's do the side by side. <laughs> so you, your name's not Brandon. No. Okay. Because we, we did have reports of the individual coming to a restaurant, a specific Mexican restaurant, to receive a carryout. And oh. it, it looks like your eyes and... No, it's not me. So you didn't take this photo? No. Okay, so let me ask you this. Would, would, would this be your, your photo? No, that's not me. It's not me. It looks a lot like you. Your name is Charlie. Yes. Charlie Bryan. Yes. Okay. Uh, do you live around here, right? I live in uh, Archibald. What is it? Archibald. 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 Yes. Okay, so you don't live at... No, I don't. No. Well, would you happen to have an ID on you, sir? Just so we can verify, because we... How about we step outside? We, well, we, we can still be in here. No, We're just at the door. Okay. Sir? Yeah, just so... Because we do report all findings to, the you know, law enforcement. Uh, we just want to make sure everyone we, we talk to is... Um, that we you get everyone... Yeah, we can go down here if you want. Now, Charlie, right? No. Am no. I in big trouble? Can I see your ID, so, please? So your name is Brandon. Okay. So, it's really not up to us to decide. Brandon, wait, right now I would just like to have a conversation with you if that's okay. Okay, so you're free to, you can have a seat somewhere, you can stand there, whatever you, makes you more comfortable. And, and you, you can hold on to that, and, you know, in case you see the guy. Now, Brandon, you, um, I understand you go by Brandon on TikTok, yeah, is yes. it? Right? Uh, how long have you been on TikTok? I don't, I don't know. Okay. Give me, give me, uh, uh, give me delete it, TikTok. Uh, no, well, we're, we're not there yet. We're gonna have to see, um, you know, where we're gonna go here. Um, now I see you. You've been having a. Have you been talking to anyone from the TikTok app? No, not really. Not really. No, no girls you're talking to on there. No. Okay, because I, I have the screenshots here. It says it looks like you were conversing with a female. Um, I have it right here. It says, uh, it says, how old are you? She says, I am. And this is on TikTok, and that's your username on TikTok. You say, I could be your dad. People always say that. People always say that they could be the, the dad of the they're talking to yeah okay. everybody says that to me i'm like oh they always say that no people on tiktok always tell oh, okay. me that i could be their dad i'm like no i'm not well that's something you said though see you said i could be your dad and that's that's your picture you said that i and don't you say how old is your mom is she single huh you ask her how old her um her mom is she um and this girl's name was the girl's name was on the app. The girl's name. Well, so on the on the TikTok app, I'm sorry, she goes by Nicole, but uh, on TikTok, uh, she goes by Ashley. Do you, does that ring a bell, Brandon? Nicole, Ashley, Ashley, Nicole. Um, Brandon, you don't have to delete anything. Start, I'm going to go on the TikTok app, okay. app, app talking to a girl named Ashley, and then you moved over to a text messaging app and you're talking to a girl named Nicole. Oh. Does, this, do, do you, does, this, does it ring? Does it remind you of something? Does it ring a bell? Uh, do you remember anything you were saying to this girl? No. No. Do you need a reminder then? You talk about how you want to keep it a secret. 
I, I, I didn't say that. Uh, Brandon, it's literally right here. You say, no, I want to keep this a secret. I didn't say that. She said that. No, right. This is her string of messages, and this is yours. You, you said this. Do we have the whole conversation okay. on the yes. phone? Okay. I okay. And do you remember saying this right here? Does she, meeting her, the girl's mom, does she suck his p Does he, does he lick her blank? Talking about the relationship between the girl's mom and her boyfriend. Why, why did you need to know that? I, I don't know. Okay. You ask her if she's in eighth grade or freshman. Yes, I remember saying that. Okay. And at some point you were going to watch a band play you were telling her, the Renegade Lemonade? Yeah. Is that a, that a local act? Yeah, local band. Where, where do they play? All around the area. All around the area? Yeah. One, one of your favorites? Yeah, one of my favorite bands. Okay. Do, do they endorse this type of behavior? No. No. But what do you think they would think about this? Someone who's coming to their, their performances and they, doing a thing like this? They wouldn't like, like it. I wouldn't think so, Brandon. It's just not a, it's not a good look. I and, know. And Brandon, how, how old are you? Be 46 in a couple of weeks. 46 in a couple of weeks? Yes. Okay. Uh, do you have any children? Two. Two? How old? This girl is f right around the age of your kids. Do your, yeah. kids, your kids live with you? Every other weekend. Every other weekend, okay. So I have to ask, Brandon, how would you feel if a 46-year-old man were conversing like this to your Right. So, I, what makes it okay for for you to do it? I, I don't know. Okay. You, you understand that this is borderline illegal. Yes. And morally wrong. I understand that. And being with the nature of the conversation, I I also have to ask: Is anything going on with either of your two? No. Your your is it a son daughter? I got a son and daughter. Son and daughter. Okay. Nothing going on. No. There. Okay. No. Okay. Uh, I know so better what's than that. you know, but you don't know better than this. So I have to ask, what is what's the interest here with another <laughs> or <laughs> nothing? I don't know, Brandon. I mean, you talked about beating her at Kalahari, going in the pool, and asking her if what would happen if her panties I slipped did, off. I didn't. I didn't go. But but what I'm saying is, there seems to be an interest. I didn't. I didn't. I had no interest going down there. Okay, but you you just talked about is it like a. What's the reason for it? Just joking around. Joking. Is it sort of a thrill you get out of it? No, no. Okay. And then you send her this meme. You say, open shirt challenge. Pop was, your buttons. I was just joking around. It seemed, well, it seems like that means you wanted to see I was just her, I was just joking. her breasts. But it was a well, joke. How would you feel if an adult sent that to your son and daughter? Do you I think you take it as a joke? Or? No, I wouldn't. So when you said, I would hold you and rub your feet, then rub your shoulders, that was also a joke? Yes. Well, what's funny about that? Did I miss the punchline? I was joking around. Doesn't seem like a joke, Brandon. Are there any other girls you're talking to no, online? No, I'm not. No. I mean, you ask her if she's played with herself. You ask her if her blank has ever been wet inside. Oh, has ever been wet I besides just, being in the shower? I just joke. I, I joke a lot. These aren't jokes, uh, Brandon. These are sexual just, advances and borderline felonies. Okay, all right. I don't see a joke here. Okay. I mean, we're not laughing here, are we? I, I understand that. Okay. What do you think your TikTok fans are thinking? Yeah, you have, what, a couple thousand followers, I understand? Um, Give yeah. or take. Okay. Has anybody made you hot and bothered? You ask her that. I, I just, I just joke around with just people. Joke around. Well, I, are we making you hot and bothered? No. Would you say no? Okay. No. Uh, and I have to ask the, the thing about the the mom's boyfriend. Have Have you ever seen your mom's boyfriend in his boxers? And you said, I'm sure he's got a big, dick. Yeah. And then you ask, does his bulge out of the underwear? What? You can't expect me to believe that was a joke. I just, I just joke around with people. Okay, Brandon. Is is this some sort of fantasy? The whole mom and the, the the mom's boyfriend and the. I I have no idea. No. Okay. So I, I have to ask you: In your situation, have your kids ever seen your bulge out of your? No. They no, they've never seen that. No. 
because it seems to be something you're interested in. No, I'm not. And being that you have access to, it seems you have frequent access to people in within your household, it's a bit of a concern. No, I don't. But do you understand why it's a concern? Yes, I understand okay. that. Okay, I'm just making sure you understand. And then, so were you joking when you sent this uh, picture of you and your in your underwear to her? No. Yeah. That wasn't a joke. Yeah, it was a joke. That was, was a oh, that was a joke too. Yes. What, was, what, what was the joke there? I I don't know. I was just joking around. Just joking around. You said you, you thought, hey, let me send a picture of my underwear to this. Oh, and it was just just a joke. Yeah, I thought it'd be a joke. Okay. Did anyone think it was funny? No. Uh -huh. Did anyone think it was funny? I, I don't. I don't know. Gotcha. And you send her a bedroom play meme with a list of a bunch of different things. You say you can only pick three. There's things like cuffs, ankle cuffs, blindfolds, and the belts, and the list just goes on. Like I, I say, I would, I just like to, I like to joke around. Okay. Is that your basically your answer for everything I'm going to ask? It's all just joke, that's, joking. That's what it sounds like. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I just wanted to, I just wanted to make sure on that. And, and Brandon, with the image you sent here, the the nude image of you and your your bare bottom hanging out there, that, that was that also. Yeah. It was just a, that, was, it, that was a joke. Yeah, so it was a joke. Do, do you send this picture to a lot of people? No, I don't. Who do you send it to? Who is it reserved for? Nobody. What, why send it to this girl? I, I don't know. Were you not? Who, what were you looking to get out of it? Like, what, what was the, Nothing. the motive? I'm not getting out of anything. Okay. I mean, just out of out of the picture. Though, what was the? What did you have to gain by sending that? Nothing. I didn't have okay. anything to gain for it. Okay. So what, why send that picture? I don't know. Uh, I'll tell you, Brent. You sent a nude picture of yourself to I, who you knew was a I female. That understand. that right there is a federal offense. Okay. I understand that. Okay. And we've already touched on the you know the whole Kalahari thing. And you said you weren't serious about meeting her at no. Kalahari. No. Okay. Okay. Because you ask her if she wants to go on the lazy river, and ask what if your panties came off at the bottom of the pool, and I'm then just, you. S I'm just. I was just playing around. Just around. joking. Okay. I, I like to joke about stuff. Yeah. You say if I was there, we would have to go somewhere and talk in private. If I went. If you went. So what, what would you have to do in private? Huh? What? Why would you have to talk to her in private if you went? I. I don't know. Saying she asks what you would talk about. You say nothing. Just talk in private where nobody's around. So what were you planning to do in private with? Where nobody's around. Well, what what did you I, have to I say? If I did went, yeah, if you I, did go. I don't. That's too far away for me to go. Well, I understand, but if you if you were there, then I wouldn't have gone. But for the private part, I mean, what what would you have done with her in private? Nothing, just talk. Just t literally just talk. So yes. why can no one be around them? Yeah, what would you do if you saw her? Got to crack those private jokes, you know. Yeah. Just we would just talk. That's okay. Talk, yeah. Mm -hmm. And then there's talk of, um, you know, she brought I'm up her. her pizza order. Okay, yeah, it's fine. And she um, brought up her cousins. You seem to be interested in that. You ask how old they are. You say, what if your top came down at the bottom while I was watching you guys come down the water slide, meaning at Kalahari, potentially? I mean, th I granted, th this is a thought. This is, you know, a thought that was going through your brain. You typed it out and sent it. I don't think half the time. Don't you Obviously. think you should think a little bit more? Yeah, Brandon. I do. I do. Yeah. So, well, um, I, I have to ask Brandon: Is there anything? I, I guess what kind of things do you? What else do you do on the internet? Nothing. So TikTok. Uh, do you have any other social media? Uh, Facebook. Okay. Uh, Snapchat. Twitter. Okay. What do you do on those? Follow sports teams. Okay. You talking to anyone on, no, on I don't those? No, no, I don't. Okay. Um, yeah, just go to your. If I could just see your following tab. My uh, what? Oh, right there, following. Yeah, if I could just see what kind of pages we have here. A lot of uh, looks like a lot of females. Not so many sports teams. They're people I went. I I I went to school with. Let's see. So, which one is the one you went to school with? Um. Cousin, people I went to okay. school with. It, it looks like you're following a lot of bots. Huh? Looks like you're following a lot of bots. Like not catfish, not real, not real people. That's what it looks like. And they're all real people. They're all real. Yeah. Oh, oh okay. 
Any younger females you're following on here? No. She looks pretty young. Who's, uh, Who? who's, who's, who's girly Buckeye, babe? Yeah, who's, who's, who's out? She's a Buckeye fan. Buckeye fan. Oh, you met her. Oh, for, for through, through the sports, like the yeah. Tam Tampa Bay Bucks. No, Ohio Tampa Bay State Buckeyes. Buc okay, what team was I thinking of? Tampa Bay. Tampa Bay. I'm, I'm who's, 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 the, who's the football team for Tampa Bay? Buccaneers. The, it is the Buccaneers. Buccaneers yeah. Oh, it's, but it's Ohio, Ohio, Ohio State Buckeyes. I got gotcha. you. I got gotcha. you. People that I know. That okay. Are, are, uh, okay. I'm school with and I, I've known around here. And okay. And Buckeye fans. Okay, I see. Well, what would the mother of your children think? Oh, this Be upset. Is, are you, you're still in contact with her now? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Do you think you should maybe give her a call and let her yeah. know what's going on? Am I in trouble? Uh, it's really not up to me to decide, Brandon. But, you know, if, if you are in trouble, you only get so many phone calls in the clink. That's what they say. Don't you think it's best that she knows the truth? Huh? Don't you think it's best that, that she knows the truth? I really don't want to tell her. I understand, but if, if you don't tell her, then a detective may tell her. You know, who, who would you rather her hear it from, Brandon? Uh, maybe you should g at least get her prepared for, for that. So, what do you what do you think, Brandon? Am I? I lose my kids. Do you think so? Why, why do you think that would happen? Let me go down here a little bit farther. Okay. How far down do you want to go, Brandon? Sorry. Okay. Well, I mean, don't, don't you think it's information that you're? the mother of your children should know? Because, I mean, she's, the reality is she's going to find out anyway. Why, there's somebody going to her house? Uh, not to her house, but, you know, someone will most likely get in contact with her. They just let her know the situation because, again, it's a concern that, you know, you have, you have two children, Brandon, and, well, you know, been, things like this are going on online. and i just been talking to her. Okay. But but a from week the or two, two you've weeks? been talking to, to this girl yeah a week or two I think it's been a little longer than that a couple of weeks uh, a few weeks at least a month okay I do you not remember no I don't okay it looks like well, I don't have an exact date on here uh, since uh, somewhere around January January sixteenth okay. e or even before that so well over a month okay. you know we're in March now so. You know, it's just, um, it just seemed like you were adamant on meeting up with this girl and we just wanted to no, stop I a... No, I didn't. I okay. Just, but but, I, but it, it just seemed like that, you know. I was just joking or I, I like to joke around. It just It's all just a big joke? Yeah. Okay. So you were sending these messages and sending that picture of your of your bare bottom and it was just hee hee ha ha, this is funny? Yeah, I was just, yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, I mean, how, how would you, how, how do you think someone's, like a father of someone's daughter would feel about no, that? Be, you don't think they would think it's funny, no, do you? No. Yeah. I, I wouldn't be, would I be happy with it, too. Yeah, if it was your daughter? Yeah. Yeah. So, it's just hard for me to believe that you were honestly joking when you sent these things. I, I was joking. You were joking. Yes. But you just said on, to someone else, it wouldn't seem like a joke. Huh? But you, you just said that if someone's daughter were to see, the, or I'm sorry, if someone's father were to see their daughter getting those messages, that they wouldn't think it's funny, right? No, they you, wouldn't. You seem to be the only one that thinks it's it's funny here. I, would, I just like to joke around Okay. Do, do, you, do you still think it's funny? Not right now, it's not. Okay. But before this you did? Huh? Before this it was funny? Yeah. Okay. Okay, that's what I'm trying to understand here. Okay. What do you uh, do for work, Brandon? I work at a factory in Archibald. Okay, that around here? Yeah, about Whoa. 15 minutes from here. Okay, well, what do you do there? Uh, put furni put uh, furnitures in the, we put furniture, uh, units, it's units, like Units? Furniture like furniture? Units. Furniture units? Yes. Okay, like assembling furniture? Yes. Okay, how long you been doing that? 25 years. 25 years. Retirement's coming up soon now? A few years? No. No? A little bit longer? 
59 and a half. Huh? 59 and a half. Too early. Oh, that's too early even? Okay. Maybe yeah. in my 60s probably. Okay. Okay. What's uh? What, what's your plan at your, at your retirement? I have no idea. Okay. I hope it's not more of this. No, it won't. No. Okay. So on, on a regular basis, how many, I guess, people come into your, your live? Because you do go live on TikTok often. I, I have no idea. Okay. And I, I, de I delete them and block them. Well, what was the exception for this girl? I have, I don't know. Okay. You just, just went on the whim, figured that you're going to talk to her? I guess so. Okay. What, what was it about this girl? I, I have no idea. Okay, just, just, just a random thing? Yeah. I got gotcha. you. I don't do it all the time. Okay, just, just once in a while? Yeah. Okay. So who, who are the others that you talk to then if you just do it once in a while? I have no idea. You just talk to them then forget about them? Yeah. Yeah, I see. And I delete them and block them. So it's a thing, it's a frequent thing for you to talk to people online no, for some period of time, delete them, and then delete them and block them. Yeah, if they yeah. start saying stuff, I delete them and block them. I see. But here, you were the one saying things. Okay, thank you so much. Huh? But in this instance, you were the one saying things. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, it's just, it's just hard to believe, Brandon, and hard to, hard to fathom. I mean, what makes a, a father of two children do, do a thing like this? Similar ages. Yeah, similar you said your son and daughter are similar, similar ages. Oh, I know. Yeah. I have a nonverbal mm. autistic son. I see. I see. Well, well, that's just, I mean, being that you're, you're doing anything like this is just, I'm at a loss for words, Brandon. I really am. I know. I didn't mean it to get this far. I just, when, I just like to joke around with people. Okay, when, when were you planning on, I guess, cutting it off if you didn't want it to get I, this far? I don't know. Until you got caught? No. Un until you met her? No. Until you just said, uh, I'm, I'm done with it? Yeah, I'm done with it. Well, it was already, uh, I mean, we're already two and a half months in. I think if my math is right. Or no, a month and a half in. We're, we're already a month and a half in since you started talking to her. I mean, it's not like it went on for a day or two. If it went on for a day or two, we, we wouldn't be having this conversation, Brandon. I understand that. Yeah. It's an immoral, illegal thing. I, yeah, I understand that. Yeah. Were you just coming to pick up a carryout? Yeah. Okay. What do you usually get from here? I get different things when I come here. Okay. What was first supper tonight? Um, it was Rojo con Polo. Uh, Rojo, ro, Rojo ro, Rojo con Pollo. Oh, that looks that looks pretty good. Is it is it ready? It was when I walked in. Oh, when you walked in, you're coming to just pick it up, and you're going to go back home. Yeah, I see. Okay. Well, it's a it's a good thing we you know we we caught the bounty today. I mean, you know, we we've been posting the uh, you know these flyers all over. People are uh, seem to be interested in the. Uh, the fifteen hundred dollar incentive. So, but we'll probably have to, you know, take them down because you know we uh, obviously, uh, you know, we we were able to to find you, thankfully, and, and stop you from. Well, you said you weren't going to do anything, but st potentially stop you from doing a, you know, a bad thing. Yeah. I will. Well, you, you don't have to do anything, Brandon. I will delete her. Well, don't delete her yet because you know the the detectors are probably going to want to you know look through that and everything. So it's probably best that you just you know just, just keep everything as it is. Um, yeah. I can delete her off TikTok. I I can delete her off TikTok. I see. Well, well, you know, just hold off on that for now at least. Do you have anything else you have to say here? No. Okay. Well, what I had to let you know is that I'm Skeet Hansen with the Predatorial Investigation Unit. Um, we're actually doing an, an online series about adults who try to meet up and talk sexually to I understand that. Okay, and, and you've, you've just been skeeted in 4K. So, um, you know, again, if nothing else, then 
I guess we'll patiently wait for the authorities to address the situation. Because, you know, we do have to report this to them. So where'd you uh, pull the name, uh, what, what was it, Craig? Was that Charlie? Charlie, right? Where'd you, is that something you just pulled out of your ass? Ch Charlie, name. Charlie Ben, Charlie Brian, right? Is that what you said? Yeah. Just first thing you thought of? Yeah. Okay. Why did you deny it at, at first? Scared. Just scared. Okay. Oh, absolutely. Understandable. Yeah, we, um, you know, asked the employees if they had, uh, you know, if they'd seen you. They said no. Do you not come here often? Uh, not very often. Not too often? Okay. I don't very, very rarely eat Mexican. Mexican that much. Okay. I try to just get a once in a while craving for it. Yeah. Yeah, I hear you. Yeah. It's definitely one of my favorite foods. It's on. It's on their menu. What's what's on their menu? Oh, well, what, what you got? Yeah. Okay. Looks like they got some uh, pretty good stuff. Yeah. Yeah, they do. That's correct. Right there. Hello. Oh. 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 That looks, that looks delicious. Yeah, it does. <laughs> really yeah, that is making me hungry. What am I gonna? Is gonna take me away? Oh uh, well, it, it happens in some cases. It's really just how they want to handle it, but um. Usually they, they may detain you for questioning um, or they may just get your ID and then hand it up to their, their detectives and they'll see what they want to do. It kind of just, it's a case by case thing. We've seen, you know, guys walk free. We've seen guys, it's impossible you know, to tell. it's impossible to tell until they, until they address the situation. <clears throat> can I, can we go down here? Why do you want to go down there? Sit down. Nice. Yeah, sure, no problem. You want to sit over here? There's a ledge over here. Ledge over here? Okay. So you, you said you, you've seen stuff like this on, on TikTok? Yeah. Okay, and you're on... Video, videos like this. Yeah, and you're on TikTok pretty frequently. How does it... I, I guess, how does it feel knowing that you could be featured in one of these videos? One of those videos? You're not happy. So when you were having the conversation online, you didn't think, hey, this could land me on the front page of TikTok? Is that your ringtone? Yeah, ringtone. Like a clown nose? Interesting choice for a ringtone. You got a clown horn for some clown behavior? And... Oh, yeah, that no, sounds about right. Ringtone I have. So I got to be real with you. This In this chat log, that is, this is, it is clown behavior. De definitely not smart. I understand that. But back to the mother of your children, Brandon, don't you think, you know, she should, she should know? I, I'll tell her. Okay. I think you should, while we're waiting, at least just, you know, give her a call here and let her know. You know, just before the uh, the police come by, because we've seen cases where, you know, they have to confiscate the mobile device, things like that, to, to go through it. Yeah, I'm just telling you what would be in your best interest, most likely. Because you don't want it to come from someone else, I mean... That's the worst thing. Hey, you, you can feel free to call her, Brandon. It's fine. I know. I'm just scared. Mm -hmm. do, do you want Do you want me to tell her for you? I can. I mean, you don't have to speak. You know, but that's easier for you. I know what she'll say. What do you think she'll say? You know how stupid you are. Yeah, maybe a bit of an understatement. Was it an um? Was it an ex-wife? Were you married? No, I'm not married. You, were you married at one time? Yes. Okay. But how long did uh? How long were you married? Nine years. It's a long time. What went wrong? I fell out of love and found somebody else. Found someone else. Okay. The ex, uh, the mother of your children. Yes. He's got more than one baby mother. No. No. Oh, no. No. Not trying yeah. to set up franchises, huh? Yeah, he don't want that baby mama drama. Uh-uh. <laughs> did you end up cheating on her, or did you just no. tell her it was over? She did. Oh, she did. Oh, she, okay. I see. That's tough. 
Yeah. Want to get a table for four? No. No. Figure it offer. Okay, so what's. We have to go to the police department ourselves? Yep. Okay. All right, uh, Brandon, so if, if you want to just, if you want to come, come along with us. Yeah, you, you guys want to follow me? Yeah, yeah, yeah we, we can just drive you there. Huh? It, we can just drive you there, it's right around the corner. What, the police department? Yeah, the police department. I know where it's at. So you, I mean, we're, we're going to give you the courtesy of driving you there. Follow. Okay. You just hike. We, have a, we have a pretty big vehicle. Can I? You can guys, you guys can follow me. It, it's up to you. Oh, or, you guys can follow me. Yeah, you can follow us, but we're off, we'll give you a ride if you want. No, I'll, I'll, yeah, we'll follow. Yeah, we'll follow. Yeah, we'll you follow? follow? Okay, that's fine. Completely up to you. Just figure I'd do the, you know, courteous thing. Well, what police department is it? Uh, the Wasing Police Department. Wasing okay. Police. Oh, did you want to get your uh, your carry out from uh, the fr from Azteca? All right, well we'll be uh, we'll be right behind you. If you want to put it, put the address in for the police department for me. Still alive, huh? <laughs> oh, I know. It, it will not end well. I'll, I'll put it in sport just to make sure. <laughs> All right, boys, are going sport mode. Just make sure. So uh, there it is. Cool. Here. Gotcha, All right, so the police said they can't come out here. So right now we told Brandon and he is compliant with going to the police station and he's supposed to be right behind him. He's supposed to be driving to the police station, which is four minutes away. I'm going to be right up his ass the whole time. Whoops. And uh, hopefully he's actually going to the police department. He doesn't go on the run. Yeah. He, might, he might just go home. We'll see. We'll see. It's given us this nice escort to the police station. This is, um, yeah, this is different. I've never, uh, we've never done this before. This is wild. We're actually. Never on my bingo card that I, that I have. Predator <laughs> and we're behind him. Predator escorts us. And he's actually, station. he's actually going to the police station. I, I think. Okay. I mean, where else? He's, is he gonna turn? Yep. Yeah. He seems he's going. My brother in Christ. <laughs> Unless he's gonna like dart off on us as soon as we get there or something. Oh. I mean, so I'm gonna follow him wherever he goes. I got almost a full tank of gas. Oh no! He... See? Oh, he yeah, is. He's gone. He's gone. Yeah, I'm just right there. They're gonna ask him. He drove here. Yeah. Let's, we gotta get that together. He's going kind of he fast drove now. Himself here. All right, here we go. Still rolling, brother. Okay, cool. Seventeen percent battery life. All right. Binder. All right. All right. All right. Oh, thank you for for guiding us here. Do appreciate it. Um, I guess this is their front door here. So, uh, or is it, is it over here? Yeah, you've never been here. Have you been here? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, lead the way. Okay, well, we're here. First time you've been in trouble? Mm -hmm. Never been to jail before? Mm -hmm. Never been to jail before? No. How you doing, officer? Hi. 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 How you doing? Hello. Hi. Uh, so, I'm Skeet Hansen. This is uh, my comrade Rick. He was uh, on the phone with dispatch. Oh, yeah, supposed to be on the phone. Yeah. One moment, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah, sure. Okay. I didn't get this. Oh, oh I see. Gotcha. Yeah. yeah so, um, yes. So, this is uh, the individual that we called about. His name is uh, Brandon. For the last month, month, maybe two months, he's been having a sexually charged conversation online with um, our yeah, Ural decoy. Yeah. He sent uh, graphic images and graphic text messages. And um, today he was at a Mexican restaurant picking up uh, an order. And we, uh, he communicated to the decoy that he was gonna be there. So we went there just to have a conversation with him about uh, you know all the content in this binder. Um, I, I did print a couple flyers out for a uh, you know wanted nudist. Uh, Bit, bit of a gag, but we had to, you know, find out where he was and all that. Um, but yeah, I do have uh, pictures of him, all his information, uh, and the full, you know, chat log, if you want to take a look. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. yeah, absolutely. Yeah, take a... Brandon? This is, this is Brandon. Okay. Well, just take a gander there of uh, all the info. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I have, um, I've never had this happen here. 
Yeah, we heard, yeah. We'll have a different thing for you. Where are you from? Uh, we're from the Michigan, Detroit area. Okay. Mm -hmm. And Brandon was actually kind enough to show us how to get here. He drove, to, he, he drove, we followed him there. Mm -hmm. Are you here voluntarily? Huh? Do you feel that you are here voluntarily? Well, we, we asked if you wanted to, if, if you wanted to go. What do you mean? Do you feel that you are here voluntarily? Voluntary like? Are you wanting Basically, to be here right now? Like, no. Like, how did you end up here? Did, did they arrest you or something? Or No. They came and talked to me. Okay. All right. And I showed them the way here. Okay. Interesting. And I was, and I, when they came up to me, I was scared. Okay, this wasn't what you were expecting, or? No. What were you expecting? I don't, I, I didn't. 25. I don't know. <clears throat> you were just going to get your food, right? Huh? You were just going to get your, your yeah. food. Yeah, and then. Like you weren't, you weren't trying to meet anyone, you were just getting food and they just like came up on you? And yeah. Okay. All right. One moment. Can you post those that? Pretty much just, just all, all around town. We had, uh, what did we print out, like a hundred, hundred of them? Something like that. I don't remember the invoice. There's a lot of them on. <coughs> yeah. Yeah, we had them all like laminate. Well, we had some laminated. Uh, yeah. we, we got them. Print case, like, you know, the brand. Yeah, we got to print at FedEx and yeah. We just, we had to make sure we, we, we had enough and all that. You know, yeah. <sighs> you know a couple of... Uh, I don't know what these, was. like these wood posts here, mm -hmm. the electrical, yeah, we posted you know, a couple, couple on there, quick, you know, tape and, uh, what was it, you a couple of, uh, yeah, yeah, it was pretty windy, and uh, a couple of people in this mailbox is pretty much like, like, yeah, it's like, like every, pretty much every mailbox we could find. Yeah, we were asking around all day. <coughs> yeah. This isn't too far from your place. Is the it? last one was, uh, yeah, the Mexican yeah. restaurant. Hey, welcome. Ohio Plate, David, you guys are probably here. So yes, did you want the right, like the, the flyers to put around or anything? No, uh, just so you can. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, I'll keep them here for you. Dude, the officer can't even fucking keep a straight face. How you doing? Do you have your, your IDs? Or yeah, absolutely. I just need like, whatever information you guys can. Right? Absolutely. So, <clears throat> so the camera, is that? The camera is mine. Appreciate your assistance, uh, officer. Oh, no problem. <clears throat> That binder that you had, is that something for me to keep? Uh, you can keep the contents in it, yes, okay. absolutely. I can uh, just get them out for you here. The organization is that is predatorial know. investigation unit. Okay. Do you have like a website and all that? Or? Um, it's not a necessarily a website. It, everything goes on the YouTube channel though. Okay. I can give you the YouTube channel name if you if you need that. What is it? It's a Skeeter Gene on YouTube. It's my my online persona. Skeeter what? Gene J E A N. Skeeter Gene. Okay. I'll be right back. Again. Yes, sir. So you're all good to go. Fabulous. We're all good to go. Yeah, yeah no problem. Thank you for uh, help this evening. Thank you so much. I through a new one for you. Yeah. So, yeah. If, if I could just ask, what would see? Are you guys questioning him or do we? Uh, I have no comment. Oh, I got you. Okay. That's fair. Okay. So, yeah. Well, just let us know if you, if you need anything further. Okay. Well, let's know if we have questions. All right. Have a safe drive back. All right. Thank have you. a good one. Thanks. 
And that is the story of Brandon. It really, really is a tragic one. And I don't think he'll be back on TikTok anytime soon. I would give you an update on what's going on with his TikTok and all his followers, but he's got me blocked. So uh, not much I can do there. Even if nothing ends up happening to Brandon on the legal side of things, I just hope that he can learn a valuable lesson from this instance. But either way, it's now within the hands of the law. And there's not much more we can do but sit back and wait and see what happens. But in the meantime, we'll be keeping an eye on his TikTok, that's for sure. We all know there are many, many other predators out there, just like Brandon. And if they happen to fall into our investigation, they will be discovered and they will ultimately get skeeted, just as Brandon did on this day. I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Skeet a Predator. I've been your host, Skeet Hansen. Thank you and good night. <laughs>